Hello there guys, and welcome to another video. But today we're gonna do something quite different. We're back to the Toshiba, the 3100, and uh, we're gonna get Microsoft Word installed, because why not? You know, it's fun. So let's just do it. Uh, let's get the disk inside, first and foremost. Uh, where is it? Microsoft Word, Microsoft Word, Microsoft Word, where are you? There you are, you little rascal. No, that's not you. Oh, okay, so. Um, where is Microsoft Word? It's hiding. Oh, there you are. So set up. It's the one. We go to drive A. We list. Auto file structure. And uh, there might be a setup. Oh, there is. That's cool. So let's install it. And hope for the best. It's loading a uh, hard disk. Yeah, you were not gonna set up a program disk. Let's start your disk. Welcome to Microsoft Word 301 setup. So it helps you set up your hard disk by. Okay, that's okay. Yeah. Sort of spell programs. Your hard disk. Yeah. Okay, so let's press full path name of. Okay, let's call it MS Word. And uh, yeah, MS Word is gonna be the folder we're gonna use. Uh, hard disk. Oh my god, I, I just love this uh, color scheme for the screen. It's just so easy to read with no strain. It's clear, it's old school. It reminds me of New Vegas for some reason. Fallout New Vegas. Uh, I don't know why, but it just, you know, it's not in the drive. Oh yeah, that's, that's correct. Uh, let's get it in there, and then we press C, and it goes. It's gonna be a quick install, hopefully. Let's keep the hopes up, my boys. And we need a more, uh, word processor, I mean. <laughs> my brain just collapsed. Which has been happening quite a lot recently. Brain just going nuts for whatever reason. I know what's going on. <laughs> okay, so spell disk. I need that. I need to learn how to spell things properly. That's pretty handy. If oh, there you go. So it's gonna get a files onto onto the hard disk onto Jesus Christ. I, I'm telling you, I need to learn to spell. Oh, my spelling is so bad. It hurts. Okay, so Mouse information to the hard disk. Do do in order. Okay, so we did that. So learning word, it's gonna be the L. It's very simple install. It's very, you know, I like how they did that. They divided all the tasks. It's cool. So that probably means that we can use the mouse, which is cool. Like for a DAW software, that's gonna be pretty handy. The fact that we can. Use the mouse around to maybe save the document. I don't know how it's gonna be. Uh, I don't even know how to use the software. It's my first time. It's like a sort of um, first time. Like if sort of like a, I let's pretend it's my first time installing. Like back in the nineties. I mean, it is my first time. But let's like imagine that I'm a guy from the nineties installing Microsoft Word. But I'm back from there. I'm learning how to use it. I never, you know, never used it. You know the drill. Yeah, it's a shame. 2018, I didn't know how to use that. But <laughs> let's be honest, who knows how to use that? <laughs> From my, like, age range, probably no one. I don't have a printer. Let's quit because I... Oh, sh shoot. No. No, I, I didn't mean to do that. <gasps> no, 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 no. And exit. I don't want to install Windows. Jesus. No. Learn Word. Okay, so we have to get the install disk in there again. Because I screwed up big time. So, this one. And then we run there again. To read the folder structure. And then we can run setup. And, uh, and, uh, okay, let's set up hard disk. 
Genie. Printer information, mouse information. Uh, it's mouse driver, C. Oh, sh. Yeah, so we have to get this disc. This disc, which is this one. Oh. I was using the very same disc. For the mouse driver, let's call it Ben. Yeah, sure. See, let's go on. And now, what are we supposed to do here? No clue. Oh yeah, quit. I think it's installed because we got Word, we got Learning. We don't need the printer information, so I think we can quit. And then we can move to C. Let's get a floppy out. Then we list. Okay, so that's the wrong folder structure. Oh, there you go. Uh, CD Microsoft Word. Then we can list. And uh, okay. Read input. Oh, that's a word count. Let's see, word. Oh, look at that. Do we have a mouse? No, I don't think we do. But. Uh, hello. Wow, that's cool. Hello. This is error testing Microsoft Word for the first. Oh, oops. Time. Very dope. I love it. Color scheme reminds me of Uh, I don't know how to save as a mansion. Uh, it does have a command. Let's see. Okay, it doesn't go down there when I press command, which is concerning. Let's see what F10 does. It does nothing. <laughs> Let's learn. Uh, Microsoft Word 3.1 commands. Because I know I know it all to create a document from the command line. Microsoft Word keyboard shortcuts for Microsoft Word. Alt Q. Alt Save. It's Ctrl S. Does he, does he work? I don't think it does because it doesn't show anything. So uh, um, I think I have to figure out on my very own. Lame. Oh, wait a second there. I think I found something useful. Extend, uh, activate mini bar. Uh, is there a mini bar? I don't think there is. How are we supposed to browse? It doesn't, doesn't want me to do shit. Okay, so oh, maybe there's a manual where I got it. Uh, Microsoft Word. I mean, uh, there is no manual. Do you want a manual scan? But there is no manual scan. So how are we supposed? how to save on Microsoft Word 3.1 let's see what it does 3.1 and uh, save a Word document no I want to save a Microsoft Word DOS how to save Microsoft Word for MS DOS Uh, Microsoft Word for DOS guide. There's no guide for it. Like, seriously, Microsoft Word for Microsoft DOS guide. Please, there has to be list of DOS commands, comparison. Oh my god. Windows commands. 
Microsoft DOS commands, dude, word 3.1, Microsoft DOS. Dude, it doesn't make sense. Oh, so there is a, I found a guide. I found a guide, I found a guide that doesn't have any sort of instructions as far as commands go, which is a big shame. Oh, memories, I found a a few days ago, I was going through some long-lost, forgotten stuff when I found this baby, Toshiba 33. Oh, it's almost the same I have. I have. It's not for because it's emulated, but still the same we're using right now. Uh, it's got more RAM, it's got more hard disk, it's got a better display. Apparently, oh yeah, the display is a lot better. And it runs Windows 3.1, apparently. Or is that 3.0? Oh, 3.1. It has Microsoft Word and all the cool things and Microsoft DOS Q basic as well. It does have a lot of things going on. But then again, that's not what I'm looking for. Anyway, I'm I think I'll have to leave you guys on the dark about this uh about the command part because I really don't know. I never used it. I'm from ninety seven so uh, my first OS was Windows 95. I never had to really use Microsoft DOS, you know, other than like IP config, ping, and IP, you know, the basic stuff. But other than that, never, 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 never. So I'm sorry about that. So we're stopping the run here thing because I know how to, <laughs> how to save. So yeah, I'm sorry, but. The goal was to get Microsoft Word installed, and we did, we installed it. It works, as you can see, I just don't know how to operate it, which is a shame, I know. But, yeah, goodbye guys, take care, and see you guys later.